Louisiana Beer Reviews, Delirium Noel, or also known as Delir Delirium Christmas. A Belgian ale from Hege Brewery, established in 1654, when Belgium was part of the Heligus Romische Reich, the Holy Roman Empire of the German nation. And I believe in 1654, yes, it was the Spanish Netherlands. The Spanish Netherlands. Okay, then it became the Austrian Netherlands, and then it was absorbed by the Protestant, Calvinist Protestant Kingdom of the Netherlands, and then in the 1830s became the Kingdom of Belgium. Nonetheless, let's get on with the beer review. 10% alcohol. I had seen it before, but it was like $5.99 for this little bottle. Oh, no. Holy smoke. I just barely... <laughs> well, just wasted about a dollar. I barely tapped it and it started to blow. Um, I saw it for $3 on a closeout. They were trying to get rid of their Christmas beers. At, um, look at that. Pitiful, huh? At, at the Red, White, and Brew in Hammond. I don't like to go there because they're very expensive, but they, they have some stuff sometimes that I can't find. And occasionally they'll have sales like that. Usually you pay a lot more. Or a relatively good amount more. Uh, cream colored head. It's not too dark. It's red, rust red, bubbly. There's some sediment roiling about. Be careful though, because it could blow on you. Um, anyway, Beer Advocate was saying it was very good at B plus. The Beer and Me was saying that B plus, very fine. They call it. But this fly is attracted by that. Um, the bros said it was just plain good, B. And then Rape Beer is giving it high, like 96 out of 100. And I think 92 out of 100 for the style. It smells rich. I was looking at a little video and the guy was talking about all the beers they have. I've tried the Noel. I mean, I've tried the, uh, the Delirium Trimmins. I've tried the Delirium Nocturnum. Now the Noel. And I would like to try the Red. And there's a whole other bunch of beers, brands that that company makes. This is really a nice smelling beer. It's not anything too exotic like I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you all these different characteristics. It just smells like sweet, rich, bready barley malt. That's it. But it's wonderful. The flavor, same thing. This this beer is so bread oriented. Think of spice bread, some subtle, subtle fruit flavors, a little candy sugar, the mildest little hot bitterness to balance it out, a little yeastiness. Um, the mouthfeel is. light to medium more or almost directly in between a light mouthfeel and a medium mouthfeel 10% I'm kind of picking that up a little bit it's shining through the alcohol now I did this maple mistress from Pennsylvania and they're talking about nine and a half percent look <laughs> it didn't taste like it and I drank the whole thing pretty fast and I didn't feel it at all. Now, if I drank a 12 ounce bottle of nine and a half percent beer, I should feel it. Nothing. It makes you wonder if it's really up to that level that they're touting. Always do it. But, um, I guess they could mask the alcohol. I don't know how they could mask the fact that you don't feel it. Like the lobotomy Bach. I mean, um, Excuse me, I can't touch 
anything with my left hand, which is covered with... Now I'm spilling it. Well, I'm having a fiasco here. Just throwing money away. I'd rather drink it away than throw it away. Spilled another ounce onto the grass. Well, it's not your problem, is it? All right. Um, and it all started with that little blow up. I don't know if this is worth $5.99 a bottle, though. I mean, that seems a little steep, but it's coming from Belgium. But for three dollars, definitely, I think it's higher than a B plus. Wow, the alcohol is really coming out. <clears throat> uh, not to mention the carbonation. Um, it's getting a little warmer out here. Out yeah. Um, I can't see giving it lower than an A minus. I'm gonna say at a minimum, it's an A minus. Just don't spill it. Um, a minus beer. It's an excellent beer. I could probably be very easily talked into going up to an A, but at this point, <sighs> and when I go write the review, it might jump up to an A. But I'm gonna say A minus, excellent beer. Laissez les bon temps relay. Three out of three winners from this company, and y'all come on down to, <clears throat> oh man, New Orleans.